Pearl Spritz. Easy soda. Toronto or Vancouver? Toronto. How'd you know? The closest we get to Aperol around here is vodka. But I can put a little lime in it for you. Nah, hold the lime. And the soda. You know, Lex, as a bartender, hi, my name's Lexi. It's just fine. Trust me. Lex, come on, you got two types, okay? You got lumberjacks and girls like that. I'm not dating right now. Gotta focus on the gig with SkyMed expanding and everything. Hmm. Setting the bar pretty high, huh? Gonna fly my first medevac on a new plane with SkyMed's famous girl pilot. Got any tips? I don't know about famous, but I'm your girl. Pilot, your girl pilot. Uh, don't forget the patients, don't forget the medics, don't forget to pee. <laughs> I heard the North's intense, but my first call is just a fever. Hope it's not always so quiet. I'm sure you'll get some action. Promise? First officer, Lex. Why would anyone buy a pet that can kill them? I don't know, isn't it a little bit exciting being so close to danger? You're a pilot. Isn't your job dangerous? Not if you're doing it right. Pilots like things safe. Maybe you just haven't been taking the right risks. You might find you like dancing with danger, First Officer Lexi. Don't you go after your dreams? When it comes to flying, yeah. When it comes to everything else, You know, I love being a first responder. First on the scene, first to help, first to find a solution. Uh, but a cop told me once that the first person through the door is usually the first to get shot, too. Hey, you gotta be brave to be first. Like the first girl pilot at an airline? <laughs> Come on to you, Lexi Martine. I think you might secretly like danger. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's the thing about girl pilots. I worked way too hard it's too hard to just get distracted now. Even if I really want to. But if you think that tough kid at five is gonna turn me off, you're wrong. Somebody owe you money? You keep rubbing your palm. Isn't that supposed to mean money's coming? Yeah, in this case, I think it just means I shouldn't have grabbed that porch rail when we picked up that last patient. Mm. Got a sliver. Let me take a look at that. Oh, it's not that bad. It's just a sliver. No, that is the whole porch. I'm going to remove it so it doesn't get infected. Yeah, hop up so I can get at you better in the light. It's just this thing I used to do in cadets to help me get through the tough parts of training. Okay. I'm scared of needles. Now you know my secret. Girl, I've seen you pick up a snake with a pair of forceps. <laughs> you know what? I can handle snakes and blood and guts and puke, but ooh, needles. <laughs> okay. All right. What are we singing? Same song since I was 14. 
Row, row, row your boat row, gently row, down the stream. Row your boat gently merrily, down merrily, the stream. Merrily, merrily, life merrily, is but merrily, a dream. Merrily, merrily, life row, is but a dream. Row your boat gently row, down the stream. Row your boat gently down the stream. Merrily, merrily, life is but a dream. Are we done yet? I can't look. Mm, I finished four boats ago. <laughs> Maybe I just like holding your hand. <laughs> Should not have done that. That was wildly inappropriate. Or hella sexy. Let me clean this and we can pick back up. <laughs> no, 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 no. I. Steph, look, I want to. I do. It's just. That thing about dreams, I'm still working on mine. And it takes all of my focus. It's my whole life, really. I just don't want to start something that I can't commit to or lead you on. Sorry. The old you're too good for me excuse. That's not what I meant. <laughs> no, it's, um, it's cool. Hey, hey, this stuff happens, you know? The energy's right, but uh, timing's off. Hey, still be friends? Yeah, friends. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to walk in on you. It's a change room. For coworkers to change in? Wouldn't feel weird walking in on Novak, would you? Uh, no, no. This is exactly like that. Oh, God, that was a long night. I'm dying for a shower. I got off the SAR helicopter, and you were the only person I wanted to see, but you weren't there. Lexi. I, I thought I was doing the right thing, putting my life on hold for my dream, but I realized if I keep putting it on hold, I'll never actually live it. And after what I just went through, I'm damn well gonna live. Is that my shirt? Look, I know what to do in an emergency, but I don't know what to do when they happen to people I care about and there's nothing I can do to help. And Lex, I, I really care about you, so I, um, I did your laundry, so I'd be ready when you got home. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Steph. My bars are going to be covered by my reflective vest anyway. Yeah, but we'll know they're there. Here is to the first day of you living your dream, Captain Martin. <laughs> <laughs> Package for you, Lex. Came this morning. Oh, I checked the skids for Deep Lake. Think of it with the supplies to North House. I'll take them up in one trip instead of two. Nice. We'll get it loaded. This. Oh. A surprise. Uh, I hope you got a receipt for these. They look used. They're my dad's. Marty was his call sign. He always said this headset kept him safe and brought him luck. I called him last night to tell him he, he must have paid a fortune to get him here. That's one proud papa. Giving you his lucky headset. Well, won't be much luck if I'm late for my first run. That's my girl pile. <laughs> Let's do this, Dad. Listen to me. 
You are not alone anymore, okay? If you need me to listen so you can just vent about how unfair this is and how angry you are, I'm here. If you need a shoulder to cry on, mine are pretty strong. If you want me to tell you that you were right and that your actions were valid, I will because they were. And hey, if you want me to scream at Weezer, well, put me in, coach. I can go down now. I can go right now. Mostly, I just want you. You got me, Lex. I'm on your team. Always. Okay. Come here. You got me. Look at Lex, I... Knowing something could have happened to you, I can't handle showing up to another call to find someone I love hurt. I, I just, I can't. Love? Okay, so I didn't need a jump. <laughs> Look, you didn't want a relationship because you were afraid it would derail your dream. And I sort of thought you were worried for nothing until I got all weird when I realized that you might have to leave to follow that dream. But Lex, your passion for flying, it's who you are. <laughs> when I saw you with Weezer, I, I get it now. Your, your whole future at SkyMed, whether you ever get to go captain here again, depends on what one guy thinks of you. It's, it's kind of bullshit, actually. Well, even if I do go to another airline, we can figure it out. <laughs> Work on something. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Whatever happens, we gotta enjoy the moments we have right now. Hmm?